What's good? This is Tad Money. And today I want to dedicate this video to all my Bayesian Creoles out there. As you know of, uh, if you didn't see my last videos, I'm particularly Bayesian Creole from my dad's side. His mother is from Barbados. I never get the chance to meet her. So I don't know my family in Barbados on my dad's mother's side. But on my dad's father's side, you know, his his my his brother, my uh my basically my adopted grandfather. You know what I'm saying? We know that side of the family, but you know, not my not my mom uh my dad mom's side of the family. So I really want to say that I'm proud to be Beijing and Creole. The reason why I don't talk about it that much because my mom be having me focus on her family a lot and their nationality and so on and so forth. But we all Creole in some way, shape, or form. But for me, I am Beijing Creole. And knowing that my that knowing that my father knows my uh, my sister husband uh, stepfather, knowing that he's Beijing Creole, you know what I'm saying Beijing Creole runs deep. You know, in connectedness of my life, and me being Bayesian Creole, you know, I want to get all the shirts, all the hoodies, all the hats that represent, you know, my nationality, my culture. But when it really comes down to, it, I do embrace Haitian culture, particularly Haitian voodoo, or voodoo to be exact. That you know, I'm really addicted and obsessed with Haitian culture, knowing that they fought their way out of slavery through Haitian, Haitian Revolution, and so on and so forth. So, you know, I got love for my Haitian people, you know what I'm saying? I got love for their culture, particularly voodoo, because Haitian voodoo is more powerful than ever, and that's what I like about Haitians. But when it really comes down to it, I'm actually Bayesian, Bayesian Creole, for all my Caribbean island people. And when it comes down to my Caribbean island people, I do embrace Jamaica as well. I do embrace the ganja culture of Jamaica. I, you know, I can't say Rastafarianism because that's a religion. And also they did it, you know, they told Snoop Dogg what's up. So the whole thing is I embrace the ganja culture in Jamaica and not, not the religion source of it. When it comes down to the religious rise, I embrace Haitian voodoo as religion source of my uh, spirituality. <laughs> But when it comes out of Jamaica, the word ganja is is used throughout my whole songs and also throughout the books that I'm finna come out with that represent ganja and cannabis. So for me being Bayesian Creole, being proud that I'm Bayesian Creole, the simple fact is that I'm proud to be that way. I'm proud to be Bayesian Creole. You know what I'm saying? I just that I never get the chance to meet my father's mother. I never get the, and I don't even know if my family in Barbados is still alive. Knowing that my mom is telling me lies, talking about they must have died, all of them must have died or something, which I hardly believe that that is true. You know, it's gonna be hard and difficult to find family members in Barbados knowing that my grandmother died. So when it really comes down to it, I am Bayesian Creole. You can tell people think I'm Samoan and shit. But at the same time, just really Creole and shit, you know what I'm saying? Because Creoles can be light-skinned, you know, all sorts of form of color, color skin, you know what I'm saying? So when it really comes down to it, I'm proud to be Bayesian Creole. And I'm proud to look up to Rihanna. You know, I used to be obsessed with her, but I stopped doing that because that's only just a fantasy and not reality. But, you know, I pray and hope that one day I will get the chance to meet Rihanna, do music with her and, and hold, no, hold, no, hold nine yards. You know what I'm saying? I want Rihanna to be my handler. I want her to be my everything. But at the same time, right now, it's only a fantasy. It's only just a fantasy. So when it really comes down to it, I'm proud to be Bayesian Creole, and I'm proud to be this be this way. I'm proud of my nationality. I'm proud that my father came from a Barbados woman, a Bayesian woman, Creole woman, and I'm proud to have that in my blood. So when it really comes down to it, this is for all my Bayesian Creoles, and if you if you if you are a Caribbean Islander. Or some 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 way or some form, I got love for you. All my Haitians, Jamaicans, Cubans, you know, all my Barbados, uh, uh, Bahamas, all the Caribbean island people, man. No whole nine yards. So I'm proud to be Bayesian Creole, and I got and I can't wait to buy shirts and hoodies and to have the Barbados flag, and I can't wait to, I can't wait to represent my pride and my culture and my nationality.